Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how we can create multiple environments within our Ready API projects. The environments functionality in Ready API provides users with the ability to create multiple environments where they can define endpoints, proxy settings, and authorization profiles to be used with each environment. In this example here, I have an e-commerce project, and within this project, we have a REST service, Kafka service, and a sub service available. Now on the top right hand side of the screen, we have the environment section. And as you can see from here, we have a dev environment, test environment, and a local environment. So we can choose any of these. If we need to make any changes, we can select the configure environment section. Now, this will allow us to open up any environment. You can see here, because our project has REST, Kafka, and SOAP services, we have tabs available for all of those. Now, in each tab, it'll show all of the services that we've available. If I double click here, I'll be able to make changes to the endpoint. I'll also be able to change the authorization profile that's been used for this environment and also the proxy settings. Now we do also have the ability to add custom project properties here in the environment section. So if we do have a custom project property, we can add separate values for each environment, which again can be very, very useful for our testing. If we wanted to create a new environment, we can just select the plus icon we can give it a name. So I'll call this one staging. And now from here, we have our new environment created. Again, we can make any changes to endpoints, proxy settings, or authorization profiles. Now, when we go back to our project, we can very easily switch between environments here. And this will be reflected then within our testing. So as you can see, we have our test environment selected. If I switch to my local environment, the endpoint has now changed. Um, if we wanted to change our environment within our CI pipeline, we can add an additional argument where we can just select the environment that we want to run our tests against. So again, this makes running tests manually or even from our CI pipelines very, very easy because we can now jump between different environments instead of having to manually change any endpoints or variables that we have. Thank you for watching.